Okay, hey guys, welcome in today. I got a new fun project having to do with toilet paper rolls, one of my favorite little holiday projects. Pretty easy, not too many supplies in, in here. Um, got a couple different scissors, got my silly scissors with different patterns on. It's a good one that I use my kids for practicing how to cut with those. Um, some scrap papers, I always got a good assortment of scrap papers onto there. Of course, a toilet paper roll. Some of my classes, I might have these already pre-cut that they're just kind of measured out with the size of it. If not, they can always cut those. Just kind of make a little cut onto there. Make sure it's long enough, wide enough. As it goes onto there, you can make a little mark as it wraps around, just so that it's gonna have enough to wrap completely around the toilet paper roll. And then you can cut that. And then you can just simply wrap that around there. And I do just a quick, easy tape job onto there. So clear tape onto there, pull maybe one. You can set it right onto your desk or table. Two pieces, so they're easy to have there. Once it covers up part, you can put a piece going up and down on that side. And same thing on this side, up and down. And there is your perfectly white snowman. He look at, looks like he needs a couple little features onto him. Um, that's why I have my colored paper. And you can do a couple things different with this colored paper. Um, this will be the scarf that'll go about in the middle. So you wanna make sure it's kind of snug onto there. And then this'll be your access. If you, do, if you got a piece that's too long, you might wanna trim it up a little bit. But there's a couple different things. If you like it just like this, just straight, you can maybe just clip with the silly scissors, depending on which one and you'd have like a cool little angle on those. Otherwise, you could cut the whole thing itself on this. So maybe I'll do that with my green one real quick. All right, with silly scissors, it is a little bit tricky. I wanna keep reminding kids to use the bottom of the scissors if you go up towards the top it just won't cut as good. So I kind of squeeze it right into there, cut a little bit nice and slow, and then move my scissors towards the bottom. I really don't even cut it towards the top of it. Just keep on moving it and sliding it down until it gets to the bottom. Sometimes you gotta tear some of those last pieces out in there, so you got something like that. So that could also work while wrapping around, and maybe you like that look a little bit better. Just like that and then bring that other one around. And even kind of tighten it a little bit just to make sure it's nice and snug onto there. Press it for a couple seconds. Now I need some of the details of my snowman. So I got my Sharpie onto here. Pretty easy eye set on here will be two circles so you can add one two you want to make them big enough so that you can fit another circle inside you can leave a little white onto there eyes will be a little bit more realistic if you want eyelashes it could be a girl snowman but i'm going to leave mine a boy snowman so just an arch line kind of at the top of it, to kind of complete it, make it a little cleaner. And then our snowman nose can go onto there. I'll have orange paper out for my kids. Orange paper cut into a triangle would be our nose. All right, so there's my nose onto there. Now I can start adding some of those little features for the mouth. So I'm gonna add, let's see, I think I can do three dots on each. So I can do one, Two, three, one, two, three. And then we'll give them some three little buttons down there. If you wanna leave a little white in there, you can. Or you can color that all in. And just like that, there is our snowman out of a toilet paper roll with just a little scrap paper onto there. Looks awesome, super cool on there. So definitely if you like this project, give it a thumbs up, hit the comments down below on maybe your color that you would use 
for your scarf on there. And as always, I am Mr. Shooty. This is Mr. Shooty's art channel. And we will talk to you guys later.